hi guys welcome to cheese food arena and on today's video i'm going to be showing you how i made this good looking red velvet cake here yeah? this is my first attempt on baking a cake so lovelies watch to the end of, of this video and tell me how well i did and if you're a professional baker please point out my mistake to me i will so appreciate it right so let's get right into the video so the ingredients are flour i have two cups i have sugar one cup butter 90 grams i have milk one cup vinegar i'll be adding one tablespoon um, vegetable oil one and a half cup vanilla flavor half tablespoon eggs three red velvet your desired um, measurements cocoa powder three tablespoon baking powder one and a half teaspoon baking soda and one and a half teaspoon so i'm going to go ahead and sieve my flour And after sieving my flour, I'm going to cream my pan with some butter. After creaming, I'll um, sprinkle some flour and dust it, dust some flour in the pan. So this is my first attempt. Like I said earlier, it was my husband's birthday and I thought to make it myself to do something special for him. So I'm going to add um, some vinegar into that um, one cup of milk to create buttermilk for our red velvet cake mix it very well and set it, set it aside so i'm going to sieve my cocoa powder baking powder and baking soda together to avoid lumps And after saving, I'm going to mix everything together and set it aside. I'll break, I'll break my um, eggs, separate the egg yolk from the egg white. And after doing that, I'm going to mix the egg white until it's foamy. So I'm going to add my vanilla to my egg white. We mix. I'm going to add some red velvet food color. Then I will set that aside and mix my butter until it's very creamy and becomes light in color. After mixing, I'm going to add my sugar and mix very well. Now I'm going to add my vegetable oil. If you have a wix, hand wix, you can use it. So you can see how creamy my mixture is. So now go ahead and add the egg yolk and mix. So 
so i'm going to add my um buttermilk bits by bit and go at, go add my um flour i'll add flour add buttermilk add my flour and add buttermilk and i'll stir it in i'll turn it in add my buttermilk and add my flour So I added the last batch of the buttermilk and added my flour. So now it's time for me to add my red velvet mix. I'll mix this. Now it is well mixed. So I'll be getting my pan and I will turn it into my pan. I'll be baking this on my gas top with the stove. So it's already preheating. The cake was actually delicious. It was I I tried, yeah. <laughs> I tried. It was fluffy but not that perfect, yeah. It's not perfect it's my first attempt right so i believe that if i keep trying if i keep attempting i'm going to do better at it right so please encourage me guys encourage me with your likes please if you're just coming seeing this video for the first time please like this video drop a nice comment and please don't forget to follow the subscribe button click on the subscribe button and to my returning subscribers you guys are the best thank you for always coming back thank you for watching my videos thank you for liking thank you for commenting i love you guys <laughs> so you're going to drop your um, cake on the tabletop like this to release the air balls yeah and this is the outcome of the cake it looks over baked from the outside yeah i know but inside it was so delicious so yummy and so not so fluffy but i tried yeah i tried <laughs> for the first time <laughs> so so this is the outcome of all the cakes i made for my husband's birthday uh, which i'll be uploading the videos soon right so thank you guys for watching bye until our next video